what's going on guys just a quick update of what's going on so i will be joining um jeremy young static sp tuning and the rest of those guys at the youtube honda event that's coming up at the gulfport dragway in february 23rd so this is just a quick update letting everybody know that i will be joining um that challenge they have going on i will be bringing uh scumbag which is my four-door civic uh currently got an ls in it boosted um so now it's crazy it's funny how it came about because i originally had 450 injectors in that car and exactly about a week and a half ago i took the 450s out and put a thousand cc's in because i was running e85 and i figured i would need more fuel but the rules for the event is uh non vtec so i already have a non vtec motor i got like two of those motors i have a b20 in my basement and i have an ls in the car and the other restriction is 450 cc's which i kind of like because it, it, it makes it challenging because now it's like all right it don't matter how much money you put in that motor you could go get the world's biggest piston that block and hold you could get a bill heads you still limited to the amount of fuel that you can run so it really comes down to the tuner the setup you have and the driver basically you know what i mean um my motor makes pretty good power uh now i gotta see what it made with the 450 uh the previous the previous owner of the car said it made decent power with the 450s in it i don't know because he ran pump gas and i didn't as soon as i got it i switched it to e85 so i don't know what it makes on pump gas or whatever gas he was using when he made the power he used i just know what the car made when i used e85 so now i got to downsize back to the 450 cc's um i'm gonna be doing other stuff to the car that was originally this car is originally my honda day build car that was originally the honda day build car however i ran out of time and I, the car still made it to honda day but it wasn't the way i wanted it to go to honda day like the car has been in sanding stage for the longest like it was supposed to be painted and never been painted um so i got a lot of work i gotta do to it um the car been to the track a couple of times and it ran i'm not gonna say it ran bad it's definitely mostly set up as like a roll car more so than a, a dig car because on the roll the car will hook and go no problem but from the dig uh that car just spins man like it, it spins i put street tires on it it spins i tried drag radio some mickey thompson's on it it still spin um so i think the biggest part of this challenge is basically i got to refresh in the motor because i literally pulled the motor like not pulled it but i started pulling the motor out the car about three days ago and um so i gotta pull the motor out i gotta refresh in the motor because that was the original goal anyways so i just gotta pull it out new bearings so on so forth refreshing the motor put the 450 cc's in it now i'm gonna actually have to get the car tuned and um i gotta figure out a way to make it hook so i gotta do suspension work because i don't know what suspension is on the car and i also have to do other work to it to make the car hook because like i said the car drives pretty fine on the road it pulls hard it just don't hook from a dig so yeah i'll definitely be there um gonna start finishing the car now to get the car ready to go there it's gonna be hectic on my side because it's winter and where i live at it's gonna be snowing and a whole bunch of stuff soon because it's already cold and yeah so hopefully you know what i'm saying i get the car finished even if i don't get the car finished i'm just gonna show up anyways you know what i mean if i don't get to do what i want to do to it i'm still just gonna show up just for the fun factor of it and to support everybody that's going there i think they said zosh is going so yeah i will be there hopefully i see y'all guys there and yeah man it should be fun so yeah I'll be there.